the cats are in his room and shut in. So yeah, the delivery that's happening today, the wife just needs to make sure that the cats are, are safe. So we've uh, we've locked him in Ethan's room for just a few minutes while the delivery shows up. Okay, so I am anchoring and oh, handbrake turning this. And that's awful. What am I thinking? Let me up the anchor. Luckily, sloop anchoring is so fast. I don't know what I was thinking there, but a really terrible move. I'm not expected to see anybody else on the seas today either. Um, just because back to school and this time slot that I play, um, I'm thinking it's highly unlikely anyone from my neck of the woods is going to be playing. I thought I saw something in the water up in front, but I don't see it now. Anyway, boots in the sand. So let's get that done. We are done for the first part. Oh, I saw my first skellies with mega kegs the other day. That was interesting. So we've got something to hand in and a robo. So gunpowders, though, are always a little bit of a... Ooh, dear. Oh. Don't want to get shot while carrying that. There you go. Get out of here. Come on, let me push the robo. Oh, I'm going to have to just climb and row, I think. No, I don't want to pick that up. I want to do this. So, all smiles in the house today so far. Let's hope that continues when I pick the boy up from school. I know some parents out there, are, they're still waiting for their school to start. Some started already, but uh, back to school is in everybody's minds right now, I think. So, exciting times. I can hear my wife talking in the background. That's probably the delivery guy's here. So, cool that his, uh, his bed's here. Hopefully they just drop it in the hallway and then we can, uh, we can put that together today. Okay, you guys are no good to me. I'm going to go over there to Snuggler's Bay. I'm going to boot it over to Snuggler's Bay and I might even go in the little... Well, I won't go in the arch because it's just too much. This is a rush after all. It's just I'm feeling good so I'll probably make mistakes. <laughs> Feeling casual, which is not always a good thing. Maybe I'll, just for wind purposes, I'm going to go to the right side of this island here. Now, I haven't checked if clouds... Oh, there we go. we got the skull fort up over there, so we have nothing to worry about as far as... Uh, as the Kraken coming to get us, that's all good. So we should be streaming to five platforms this morning. And uh, I start work at 8.30, so uh, it's a very short stream, and that's why I've come up with this concept of Sea of Thieves Rush. Just keeps it short and succinct, and uh, shows people that you can play the open world version of Sea of Thieves in a small window of time, have fun, get the adrenaline going, and uh, it's a good way to kind of kick off your workday if you're in a position to do so. And if not, you can just watch me on the way to work. Not while you're driving, of course. Safety first, guys. Come on. Okay, so up in the sails. We have another rowboat here. Like It's rowboat city right now. So I understand there was some Q&A yesterday on the forums with... Uh, Chappers and Neat, I think. They uh, they gave us some little tidbits of what's coming, which I've kind of seen some things and some stuff get mentioned. And it's kind of got me salivating for, you know, future updates. And I think that's the whole point. <laughs> they wanted to keep those who are invested and engaged in the game uh, playing into the future and just being excited about what's to come. So I'll probably listen to the Keelhorn podcast. That's... Uh, that's my go-to. I listen to Mr. Logan, Captain Logan. He um, he seems to break it down quite well. 
Uh, so does Falcor in his videos. Um, so I might watch both get get kind of the lowdown and uh, see what's going on. There's nothing here. I think I've wasted a lot of time just running along the beach trying to find something. Get back to the ship. <sighs> might find a shipwreck. I could shoot some chickens, I guess, but. Uh, what's that? No, that's a bucket. Don't need buckets. My ship's floated around the island. Oh, there's shipwreck. There we go. Squirrel. Let's get over there and see what's in there with all those birdies flying around. Still have 23 minutes on the clock, so I'm golden right now. Unless something kicks off. I'm expecting to go down the hall after this and trip over boxes, so we'll see what uh, what's going on there. I got my work cut out for me today. It's been been busy, but it's been good. So um, hopefully the bunk bed is is all there and no bits missing. And you know, when you order stuff online, you you always concerned that you know the the main part, like the the tools to put the damn thing together, <laughs> are missing. Okay, so birds are right above me, so I should be able to do a leap over here and dive down, and there she is. Yes! Beautiful. Way down. The Marauder's Revenge. Boom, boom, boom. And, oh man, I'm going to be drowning before I even start. Captain's quarters, because I went the wrong way. Hey, look, Blue Jam. I'll take that. Yeah, take that. Terrible band. That's some good songs, I guess. Alright. I'm going to go back down. I'm going to regret it. I don't have any food. So hopefully I can find some in a barrel. Let's see. Food barrel. There you are. Fantastic. Not what I wanted banana-wise. Get rid of you. Okay. Don't want to eat the fish. Let's eat that. Oh man, come on. Focus. We need to focus. Mm, nothing there. It's like the ship's backwards. It's very confusing. I uh, can't really use that. I'm going to leave that there. Oh, and now I'm stuck on it. Come on. Oh, come on. Find the right thing to eat. Oh, I just ate chicken leg. Oh, well. that'll do me. I think I'll take this. Oh, come on! What am I doing? I'm all kerfuffled. I'm stuck now. Why am I stuck? Why am I stuck? Where am I stuck? Why can't I swim forward? <gasps> Wrong key on the keyboard. What a tool! What a tool I am. Drop and swim. Go as fast as you can. Can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And we have. Oh, look at that. Two Reapers' chests right over there. Wonder how close they are. Oh, do I have barrels off the back now? Am I like in Luck City today? I do. I have treasure off the back here. See if I can get all of this handed in. Make me a very happy chappy with 20 minutes left on the clock to be finding stuff like this. So if I get a lot of hunters stuff, which is possible, I might actually just want to do hunters though. So that'll be a double rush trying to get those two in. Uh, just jump in. I could harpoon it, but. By the time you harpoon it and you get it, it's like, pfft, might as well have just climbed the ladder. Seconds difference, if, if anything. Sword lunge. And we are in. Check the barrels. Nothing there. Nothing there. I'm looking for hunters, specifically. Uh, Could have grabbed the cannibals, but don't 
care for bananas. Not a scroll that I don't care for. Yeah, I'll take the cursed one. Why not? Where's that tea chest? Wow, that was pretty, pretty profitable. Do I go down to the ship again? It's too far down. It takes too long. It's going to take minutes off of my rush. I want to get this handed in, and I want to see if I can hand that fish in too, and the gem at the at the hunters. Outpost, sea post, posty, posty, post, post. Um, okay. Now, map. Let's go see if those reapers are close by. Because I'm game for that if they are. And they don't seem to be. Oh. That's too far of a trip. The other one. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Yeah, no, I'm not going to make that in time. Um, so, what do I have? Salty Sand, Spring Rune Sand, Kill Hall, Long Cove, Hidden Spring, Lonely Hour. Spoils of Plenty are. I'm going to go Sanctuary, so south, and then I might make spoils. I might not, but. Okay, uh, up that anchor. So, not bad. Not bad little haul for the morning. For a Monday. South we go. Ah, rock ahead. I'm tempted to try the Reaper's chest, but 17 minutes on a rush. You gotta, you can't make bad decisions when you're doing a rush. Okay, straighten her up. Sails are a must. No, nope, wrong one. I'm not going lights out. PvP is all part of the rush, part of the game. I'm not hiding. If it happens, it happens. I think I can handle it. <laughs> we shall see if it comes up. I've handled it in the past sometimes, and sometimes I've just completely... It's usually if they come at me that I suck. If I decide to go for them, you know, I get the element of surprise, and then I'm better at it. <laughs> I, I'm kind of decided it's not thrown upon me so we have a fruit crate which is really pointless and useless I'm not even sure why I picked that up all hail the way lord have an empty fruit crate yes I could have at least put one banana in it the whale lord's going to go hungry he's going to be mad at me if you don't know what the Whale Lord is, check out uh, Hitbot. I don't even know how to say his name properly, but Hitbot C. Hitbot. But uh, yeah, he's making some good content videos. Is that a sail? Oh no, that's the water tower right there. I really don't understand the water towers except for. Like, they're not functional, they don't do anything. I'm wondering if if when fire comes whether you'll be able to like use the water tower I don't know like sail your ship and connect it to a pipe and fill like a a, a water um, area barrels something you know have have a um, I know you're floating on water so there's plenty of water to be had Maybe it's not going to be used for anything. It could just be aesthetics. You, know, you need a water towel for fresh water if you're on a little island. It just makes sense. Okay, we are rushing to the outpost. 15 minutes on the clock. We really need to to uh, go and do the hunter's hand in too. This, is, this will be lame if I call it right now, right? Got to finish. So, been playing a few more Android games and a few more like mini games. I played Blair Witch on another stream, and it was okay. It was. It started off really, probably due to my own incompetence, um, but it, it started off just me running around 
in woodlands and not really knowing what I was doing and not really getting the whole concept. But then finally I, f I figured out how to get my dog to do something <laughs> that it was supposed to do. Um, because my dog found something in a cage, uh, a cave, and then it just sat there. And I'm like, well, what do I do next? And there was this little, like, thing above the dog. But I just thought it meant the dog had found something. I didn't mean, didn't know it meant I could interact with with the dog. Um, but apparently it did. And now I'm screwing up because I'm going to the wrong side of the island. I'm going to hit... I missed. <sighs> Come on, turn, turn, you silly boat. That's what I want, a full sail. That's really going to help. Might just be a case of dropping anchor. Boom. Ah oh well. There'll be a small hole. I've noticed with the damage system that they've well they've changed it. The holes when you hit an island aren't huge. Um, I think they probably need to do some balancing as they call it. Because um, if you go full bram into a an island, I think the hole should be much bigger. Um, but, you know, that's just me. Usually it's multiple hits by a cannon makes the hole bigger. Um, but you can't have multiple hits on an island unless you're just that dumb. Uh, <laughs> you know, it's... Uh, I would think a hard hit into an island should make a big hole right off the bat. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so first rush complete. We've handed something in. I've got to hand all the other stuff in and then we'll head off to um, the sea post and see if we can get the fish that I got that I think I'm still carrying. I ate the chicken and I'll uh, hand in the gem. So, if, oh, if I can avoid falling in water, I should do that. Because <laughs> that just adds time. All these little things just add time. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Oh, and I went under. Alright, so here I am. I'm in a full turn. I'm just going to risk putting up the, the sail. I'm going to clip the dock, I know. I don't care. It's something I can fix. I just need to go. Oh, I'm not going to clip the, de the dock. There we go. I need to go right the way around anyway, because... Oh no, Shores of Plenty is east. Uh, west. Mm -hmm. Don't want to go east. That would be terrible. Okay. Now I've got to avoid the island. I'm heading west, but a little bit too west. Okay, let's look at the sails. Not that one, you goober. Oh, I've got a headwind. Uh, well, I'll figure it out. I'm sure if I go west now, I'll be good. Watch the beach. Don't want to come in too close. I'm just sorry I went quiet <laughs> I was just catching something in the back there it sounds like my wife um, actually might need to be going into the school now um, she got the call and it was saying tomorrow but uh, that's her first day of uh, work so 
or first day of this new job where she's on on call. So, <laughs> hey, Prey Three Gaming, you're welcome. Oh, happy to uh, to subscribe and help you build your channel. That's something I'm trying to do too. So, you know, if we uh, we watch each other's stuff, comment on each other's stuff, that uh, that really helps us both rank higher when we drop videos. So uh, I think I've turned on notifications for your stuff. I will check if you'd like to do that with mine, and then uh, yeah, just head on over, watch a few minutes of my stuff, and and just give it a comment every time I drop something. That would be awesome. And uh, you know, if I don't do that, you can always hit me up with a message, um, shoot me a tweet, something like that. You know, feel free to to Twitter message me. I really try and do all of that stuff. So what I wanted to do is head to sea post, but I'm noticing there's a, squ a squirrel here. It's a <laughs> not a literal squirrel because that would be weird, but they're um, be cool, like a sea squirrel. Yeah. Anyway, um <laughs> it's a shipwreck, which is the proverbial squirrel that's made me change my tact. And with eight minutes on the clock, I'm being a little greedy and thinking I could get something else for the hunters. But I'm not even seeing the sea post, which I think is in the fog. So this could be my undoing for my second rush. Depending on how low the ship is in the water, uh, I think I'm going to anchor. And I think I can just jump off the front of the ship and be right there. Oh, it's not that low down. Good. So seven minutes. So I can only do one dive. And I've got... I've got too much food on me already, so I didn't empty my pockets. Okay, get rid of that. Get, oh, no, get rid of that. Get rid of that. I'm going to want that. Oh, I'm going to want him. Swordfish is probably a good one to have. Okay, I think I'm done here. I might be able to do a second dive just because it was so quick. Where's the ship? Where did my ship go? Fish, get out of the way. I was half expecting my ship to have carried on. <laughs> like, no! That was pretty scary there. Thought I was left alone. Seven minutes on the clock. Should I go down again? Ooh. And if I do, I've got to unload this at the other end. Clan member tricks, three tiers, share history. Awesome! Appreciate that so much. Yeah, I'm using multistream.io right now, and it's letting me stream to uh, four different platforms, including my Facebook stream. So five platforms, if you include that. So it's worth checking out, multistream.io. Um, they have some problems, but uh, for all in all, it's pretty good. Where is this place? I am so off of the... Spoils of Plenty, there it is. It is southwest. I'm going to go around the fort and then go southwest. I'm heading into the fog though, so that makes it even harder to find. I don't know whether you play much Sea of Thieves, Pray, and Forget, Pray 3 Gaming, but uh, it's definitely a fun game and the rush allows me to squeeze my little window of play into, um, into a 30 minute window, which is the whole point of coming up with the uh, the concept of Sea of Thieves Rush is just allow people to play play Sea of Thieves because people think you you have to invest like a ton of time in Sea of Thieves and that's not true you know you can if, if you're somebody that wants to progress and advance your character then yeah maybe you need to really play but if you just want to get out on the ocean and sail around and you know see what you can find and explore it's it's you don't need a lot of time at all so heading southwest it says it's in front of me oh this could be this could be weird wonder if doing that helps uh, not really right that's a crosswind but I don't want to be going too fast but I want to get there pretty quick Oh man. Okay. Let's just go for it and either I crash and I fix the boat or I just sail right by it. I had the sails the right side to begin with. Ok, 
Okay. It's coming up on the over here slightly. So head west slightly. It's gotta be right here. Come on. Let me see it. Let me see it. That's gonna be right in front of me. There it is. Fantastic. Navigating in the mist and I still found it. Very ominous, the fog, but it's awesome too. It really adds a level of atmosphere to the game. Oh, that was good. I'm happy with that. Looks like it's Emmerich here. Do I have the food in my hands? Let's see. Yeah, I'm carrying the fish. Okay, let's go. This could be second rush complete right here. Oh, graphic glitch. Ah. I'm running an NVIDIA card and it uh, it has some weird little glitches on Sea of Thieves. Okay, so hand this stuff in. Let's see what we get. I don't want to talk to you. I want to deliver. I want to see what that was worth. Stormfish. Whoa, that was good. What's this one? Six. Uh, this one's a good one too. Whoa, yay! We are done. Thank you very much. I think I'm going to call it there because I can't really do too much in the last three minutes. <coughs> so uh, let's just wrap it up with a tra la la booms yay, 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 and nearly 30 on hunters. That makes me very happy, everybody. Hopefully, your back to school day is good. You have a good Monday. You'll take care now, okay?